back to Magic TV. My name's Greg. It's six o'clock. It's time for a Magic Live. Now, today I'm here with Matt. Hello. I'm going to do a routine with the quiver and a pack of cards. This is something I've been doing for years. It's a really cool routine. Uh, if you want to learn more about it, you can check out my video, The Hows and Whys of the Quiver, that I put up over Christmas uh, in 2021, just in case you're watching this in the distant future. Uh, Matt, I'm going to show you something, like I say, with a pack of cards and a wallet. Uh, this is a little like coin purse here. You can see there's a coin in there. You can take it out if you want to. Uh, I get those coins from the mechanical industries. It's a really cool coin. It's called a grinder coin. Um, and also, we've got a deck of cards here, 52 playing cards. And, and Matt, you're going to get to have any one of these cards that you want to. Uh, it's up to you. Uh, you're going to write your name in it, so maybe one with a bit of white space, but it's up to you. Which one would you like? Uh, that one. The two of clubs. You yep. sure? Okay, one. Well, what I want you to do is write your name right now on the two of clubs. If you can, that would be great. Perfect. Good stuff. Uh, so, there's a rule in magic. I'm going to fold this up, by the way. Make sure I don't do anything weird about it. I'm just going to fold this up like this, yes? Yeah. Um, there's a rule in magic that you never tell the audience what you're going to do before you do it. You don't trust me at all, do you? It's still my card. Yes. Just checking. A, <laughs> just checking. I'm not that good. There's a rule in magic that you never tell the audience what you're going to do before you do it. Okay. I'm going to tell you exactly what I'm going to do. Right. I'm going to try. You know this person that we got the uh, we got the coin from. Yeah. I'm going to try and get this card right here into that purse. That's exactly what I'm going to do. Okay. Okay. I'm going to get that card into that purse. But what I want you to do is put that coin back in. Very good. You can see the coin in there. Is that fair? Yeah. And what I want you to do is put your hand on top for me. So I'm gonna get this card, if I told you I could get this card into that purse underneath your hand, would that be good? Yeah. Well, the only way to do that is to, I can't obviously make something jump into somewhere else unless I do something that magicians call a transposition. Have you heard of a transposition before? No. It basically means making two objects change places. Okay. So we've got the, the coin inside there, haven't we? Yeah. Jack, do you see that card right there? Yeah. Watch. One, two, three. What? You see, what I've just done is I've just taken... Let me just put those over there. I've taken that card and turned it into a coin. That's the coin that was under your hand. You're not going to believe this. Lift up your hand for me. I don't want to. Yeah, you've got to lift it up. Because this is really weird. Do you remember I said the coin's been here the whole time, yeah? Yeah. Look at what's inside there now. <gasps> There's a card. No. Take it out yourself and unfold it. That is the one with your name on it. And that's magic. Any questions? It's weird, right? That's a good one, dude. Thank you. That's <laughs> good. <laughs> that's a really good Holy shit. <laughs> I know, right? I could feel the coin under my hand. I know, right? So weird. That's fucked up, bro. Like that's <laughs> that's a good one. Well, there you go. Holy shit! Translation: All the others were shit. Uh, <laughs> guys, do me a favor. If you like the video, let me know down below. Uh, leave a comment, like the video, subscribe to the channel. I'll be back again tomorrow at six o'clock with Magic Live. Mm.